Hey, welcome back everybody. You're just in time for another episode of Plucky Squire. This time we finished off Frog Mountain and saved Thrash's village, but now we're on Boogie Beach. Seeing where this treadmill takes us and just seeing how long this episode will last. So good to go. The vibe! Been totally killed. Massive great vehicles come rolling through. Lots of soldiers with real bad attitudes. Never really hear good things about Humgrump's gang, huh? Nothing about their good hygiene and impeccable manners. Well, don't worry, Flamingo Dude. We're on our way to sort things all this all out. Lucky Squire and company coming through. Can we talk to everyone? No? Okay. We still gotta be on the lookout for any... Oh. Gotta look out for soldiers, but at the same time still looking for any collectibles. He didn't have any cash on him. Oh, they only dropped one coin? The palm trees are the best part of this whole this whole area. They got shades and everything. I guess we're gonna be winding up fighting soldiers throughout this whole place, I guess. Okay, full health, gates down. And away we go. Oh, just squids in the ocean to deal with? I'm assuming we- oh, they're one-shots, okay. I was wondering if we had to keep throwing the sword orang at them. One-shots, okay. There we go. Not much to break here. Gates are gonna open. I guess the whole map here is supposed to be a squid on the ground. The two eyes and whatnot. Could just be a qui uh, could just be a coincidence. We buried him good. Ha ha. He he he. Nice and cozy like. We're totally just fine doing this. How'd you like these beautiful pink sands of yours now, eh, little starfish? Yo bozos. This is exactly the type of thing that has earned you a terrible rep. Troublesome pe persons, get them. How many shots does the green guy take? Four? Yeah, go oh, four. Those beastly bullies. They buried my poor sweet husband in the sand. Don't worry, Mrs. Starfish. We'll soon have your dude out. Or not. That is really sturdy sand. It's boogie sand. Very viscous. Easy to bury things. Hard to dig them out. Boys are gonna have to tough time, no matter- mo no mistaken. There's only one fellow who could dig my man out of there. Humba. Tumba? Tumba! A little round flamingo, he is good at digging. Find Tumba so we can dig up my sweetheart. You got it, Mr. S Mrs. Starfish. Any advice on where to find this Tumba dude? Well, now, around this time you'll usually find him napping under a tree. Sleepy bird, that one. Got, I've been scoping this place out since we got here. Didn't see any round sleepy dudes around under the tr any trees. Maybe you could spot who we're after. From a different vantage point. <laughs> From outside the book, of course. Uh, can I find anything behind the rocks? Nope. Is he like on a little island? He's probably on like a small island in the last page. That's my guess. Uh, nope. Uh... Oh, okay. I thought this was just like a goblin. Ruby, what's that? There's a starfish buried, huh? Should be a job for Tumba. You lead the way. <laughs> Look at him run. He's got a shovel. We're back at Boogie Beach. Justin Tumba beheld the funky land of Boogie Beach. 
I did not think that's what he was gonna look like. Okay, we're back. The vibe! It's been totally killed! Wait. I feel like I repeating myself. Bad stuff happening, huh, Sokka? Best believe it, Tumba. On my way, stay safe now. Hurry, Tumba! Oh, we gotta fight him again? Help me, Tumba! Ooh, that was a good hit! Like, five hits? Ooh, these are some good throws! I, every time, like, I do the melee attack, I just think I'm invincible for some reason. Like, I don't think collision during my attack should count as a hit. That's probably where I've lost most of my health, is just random hits like that. Oh, we gotta do all this again. Luckily, there's still just one hit. There. Take out the rest, then we're good. Hurry, Tumba! Probably gonna have to fight some soldiers when we get to uh, the starfish. Oh, no. Tumba! Ooh, that starfish been very bad. Let's see what Tumba can do. One scoop is all it took. Stanley! Thank Boogie you're alright. The sand. So deep. So endless. Millions of tiny permoidal stones. Stanley? Banging job, Tumba dude. Oh, it'd be nothing. You both here to stop all the bad business? I'll be Tumba Will. Tumba's not big, but knows these beaches. It has a shovel, can dig up useful things. Tumba dude, that'd be rad. We could use your help. You got it, let's roll. Okay, we got Tumba. Probably will carry us compared to Thrash. Ooh, this is a big room. There's Martina. We meet again. Care to take a look? I don't have much cash, actually. Okay, still missing that one. Some early concepting of game environments. This would eventually become Boogie Beach. That one looks... That reminds me of Mario and Luigi Superstar. Like when you're in the beach area on that game. Oh, well, here's a block. Watch out ahead. Those grumpy... Those grumpies causing havoc. They've got a giant balloon. Maybe they're having some kind of party. The soil's terrible for our feathers. Messy lot, these grumpies. I'm assuming grumpies are humgrumps men. Yep. Hey, look, those... Looks like Humgrump has this place locked down. Yeah, let's lower that gate. Somehow. Not sure on the details. Tumba has motto. When in doubt, dig. Something buried over there. Tumba, help you uncover it. Is it the X? Yeah, it's the X. Okay, first let's break these. For any possible cash. And what about this? This is suspicious. Ah, okay. One of these boomy portals way to go, Tumbo dude. Jock can use these to get her head. Before that, let's... Oh. I wanted to break whatever that is. Uh... I can't turn it. What can I do here? I can turn the page. I can't lift, though. Oh, yeah, I thought- oh, I thought it was just gonna automatically put me in one. Uh, I don't think it did what it's supposed to. I thought it would just set me up and put me right in it.
There we go. Four squids. Four squids gotta die. Oh, jeez, they got bombs! <laughs> A glitch bird! I need them. I'm wondering if I can just run all the way and open the door, or if I have to kill everything along the way. Just hack and slash my way to victory. Oh, a little bit of health. Yeah, it's a enemy door. There we go. Let's go, guys. Bang job, Jot. Pumba's on the way. What about this, though? How do you get by this? <laughs> you could have gotten out of that. Our troubles just floated away on the breeze. Let's get going, dude. Give me that glitch bird. Maybe we come back with bombs or something? A lot of weird blocks there. Apparently it's totally seized up, won't open. Some associate didn't fill out the gear grease access forms. Very poor paperwork. A clear case for a naughty associate behavioral report form. As clear as a case as I've ever seen, Soldier Dob. Wait, is that, are they? Troublesome persons. Yes we are. Help me, Tumba! Well, that be a big gate. Violet, get out of here. You've been replaced. Oh, uh, hello, gang, I found you. Violet, what the, where did... Huh? Moonbeard didn't tell ya. Well, I suppose he wouldn't, he's very busy. Finish up mixing up my potions, so old Mr. B, MB, sent me here to help you two gents. Wait, who's this little pink birdie? He's so darn cute. Tumba is the name. Tumba dig holes. Tumba has been helping us navigate the beaches. Helpful dude. Hey, it's been a while. Triple Trouble reunited. Oh, Three's dancing good. Tumba can't dance. But Tumba can dig. And Tumba can find things that others can't. Tumba show you. <laughs> uh, Tumba's thing in this path will take you where you're heading. Well, we're not going that way yet. Can we come back? No. Does Violet know how to break these black cases? Hey, okay, now we got a four, man. I'd easily replace Violet with Tumba. Okay, start digging. Oh wait, don't go through. There's an X here. There we go. Please be the next one. I hope I didn't miss any. Entrance to the caves looked honestly pretty spooky. Initial sketch of top-down gameplay. Narration text appearing in the environment was a planned feature since the early days. Okay. Good to know. Humba did his job. If you see any X's in the sand, just dig. Every time. Army mateys. You're in Buccaneer Bay now. Years want to be leaving, you best open the gate ahead. If years want to be opening that gate, you best be finding two shiny jewels. If years want to stay, you can come live with me on my rock. Okay, we got water. We got more soldiers. Meanwhile, no one wants to help me fight. Hey, 
Okay, I need two jewels. All we got is water. An X. Is there anything else? Here's Mini Beard. Lots of interesting looking places in the water here. Shame you can't get to them. If only the water was frozen solid, you could walk across. Frozen solid in this heat? Fanciful. Is there anything else I can do? It all seems to be one way. The other way. Where's the nearest portal? Oh, there it is. Okay. I don't know why they have to make it a secret. Like, I had to get really close for that to appear. Okay. Looking for some words. Where can I find some words? Any portals on the sides? Nothing. Oh, no. Nothing. I guess the title cards or the story cards can help. Off our beach battle boogie. That's as far as I went. Boogie Beach. I'm just seeing if there's any ice like words around here. That's Starfish. The one with the glitch bird that I haven't found yet. Yeah, that's basically it. Anything else I can do here? No, this looks like it's just the standard layout. Don't fall off the edge again. Oh, there it is. Okay. Another hidden portal. Pumba, I need ya. Oh, another one. Box of Ice kept this starfish chilled. Not anymore. Got a lot of tumbo work to do here. Okay, Tumba, start digging. That's it, Tumba, come on. I need real results. A launch, okay. Let's replace ice with water, see what happens to the starfish. If anything. I guess water is ice. Okay, just leave that there for now. Fire! Okay, everyone's down. I have to hit all the switches. That's no problem. I know what needs to be done. I'm just... Okay. Oh, okay. I got it now. Oh, the rest of the team can't walk on ice. That's what I'm hearing. Okay. It's back to water. Here we go. Good 
there. Give me that gem. It's a blue gem. Again, I don't know why we have a jump button, but we have to press triangle to jump at platforms. I think that's crazy. Okay, ice. Turn water into ice, and away. Oh, Pip Jot does it too. I thought it was just the cast. Wow, my sword took forever to come back. This little star man has nothing to say. Another word. Okay, so I have to dethaw and come back. This page may have the most portals on one page. Okay, turn them into back to water. In we go. Okay, that should be everything. This is one, two, three, four, five portals on one page. There we go. I honestly think the swamp was still the hardest area of the game. Like, just for the sheer amount of puzzle. The amount of words you have to juggle. Yar, you went and solved the puzzle of the bay, didn't you? You'll be on your way, no doubt, no doubt. Won't be living with me on my rock. Roger understands. Life on a rock ain't for everyone. Good luck, me hearties. Okay. Here was a secluded area under a leaf canopy. Huh, little Tumba, are we going the right way? Tumba knows these beaches like the back of his wing. Tumba won't be letting you down. No secret words, okay. We got flower enemies. You can't attack the trees for secrets. Hey, get out of that bush. Or come back. Hopefully Tumba doesn't die by the end of this or something. A grumpy bunker ahead, and some kind of metallic oily smell in the air. Oh, there's guys inside! Oh, you can just walk inside, okay. Another gate open! Oh, we gotta deal with a tank next? Tanks! Ahead lay dangerous looking machines. Well, those things look mean. Yeah, it'll look like they'll blast our heads off if we try mooching past. Hello, my chickadees. Looks like you're getting close to the heart of the grumpness. Thrash is right. Those tanks will blast you into biscuits if you try to run past. Not if you blast them first. With what? A guitar solo? No. With something that Jot can retrieve from the world outside. Hop to a Jot. Moonbeard out. Moonbeard sounds busy. He still has a lot to do when I left. Hope he's remembering to hydrate. Anyway, Jot, sounds like you need an item from the out there. Go do your jumpy thing. Good thing a portal showed up. What are we dealing with now? Dinosaurs? Climbing to the top again? Soldiers everywhere. I deal with... Goomba. Another stamp? Looks like we'll talk to someone at the top, too, it looks like. Okay. First step is collect all the cash we can find. What's Moonbeard saying? Alright, look, you'll need to, two orbs to open the big gate. Save one orb in the jungle over there to the right. Hope you're a fan of humidity and heavy foliage. Okay, we'll do that after collecting all the treasure.
Gotta find any puzzle piece or uh, art as well as while I'm doing this. As long as I'm on track for not missing any, that's the main thing. Anything else? Oh, big cash, okay. Oh, th this is kind of cool. It being a jigsaw puzzle. Oh, that's really cool. I like this one. Is it a bouncy ball? What is this? I can't tell what that is. Oh, it's over here. This may be the coolest... Like... This setup may be the coolest thing of the game so far. I wish I had a bigger puzzle of this. That'd be cool. Okay, I guess I got my... Bouncy ball? I think that's what it is. It's not bouncing. Do I need this ball for anything? Oh, a little bit of cash. Oh, what's he saying? No, oh, I want to talk to Minibeard, not this. There'll be one and two orbs to open that big old gate. There's one to the left in the desert land. Beat the enemies to enter the desert. Don't get sand in your socks. Yeah, I guess this is one of the orbs. I'll put it over there. Put it over there for safekeeping. I'm here for the cash. Ow! Anything else? Just kill everything I see. That should be all of them. But no art yet. Hopefully I didn't miss any. Oh, hello there. Welcome to the desert plains, man. We got lots of cacti and sand. And this orb of ember belongs to somewhere else. Feel free to take it. Now oh, found it. Okay. I was expecting the usual five bucks from this. From whenever I run, walk these mugs. Don't ever doubt me, son. I'm high on calcium. While exploring ideas of incorporating worlds and gameplay, we briefly encountered the idea of Jot engaging in a rap battle with various other opponents. In this case, a carton of milk. Little Milky and Latch. Oh, he's got the shades, even! Good luck on your journey, man. By the way, I heard a rumor. Apparently there's something arty on the right side of the windowsill. Sounds groovy. Farewell, man. Okay, away I go. We got what we came for. So one up here. I would need the other.
Bring it all the way and slam it in. Oh, a little more. I'm out. In I go. Finding every little bit of cash I can. Oh, I see pictures. Yeah, I really hope there's more of that those puzzle like I hope there's more puzzle piece like puzzles where you have to walk through them. I need that letter or that sticker. Okay, I gotta go up. Yo, Jot, this T Rex behind me is wild. Demolish the fence out of pure rage. No reason with a Tyrannosaurus. Bend your toes. I just wanna get up there. Art is top priority. there. Come on, get up there. Get rid of the bombs. There's probably an achievement for getting every upgrade for Jot 2. I'll be chipping away at that. He's going down. Hey, up! There's a big friendly dino on the left. Climb onto the dino's tail to continue on your way. Remember to be polite while you're scampering across its back. First, I need that letter. Who's that tickling my tail? You seem like a friendly chap. Say, maybe you could help me out. There are pesky creatures running around on my back, and I can't seem to swat them off. They're, they're cult rats. Ah, uh, could you perhaps get rid of these annoying little things? Rats with hats. Okay, grab the page. Probably the next one in order. I don't think I've missed any. Okay. An exploration of the look of the room. There was a useful reference for the 3D artists. The art was drawn by Merlario Calaval Conti. It looks just like Andy's room from Toy Story. One more rat. I only take two hits. Thank you, little fellow. I can think again. My mind is clear. He can make portals in his head. He just has to think about them. Got T-Rex. Can we attack the trees? No. How do? The item you're searching for is at the top of this volcano. Volcano is heaving with prehistoric beasties. You only survive by releasing your inner caveman. Get primal, lad. Can we become muscle jot for this? 
Yes, no. Oh, there it is. Another one. That's like three on this overworld. A concept piece of John emerging from the book. For a while, he was drawn with a cat companion, but eventually Pip took a companion role. The cat was pipped by a mouse. Okay, that's another one for the collection. The rest are just all raptors. Okay, uh, what do I want to do here? Where was I doing? I got through all of the beach, and right now I'm looking for a new skill. Yeah, maybe before I go climbing the volcano, maybe I'll call it quits here. And then next episode, start climbing the volcano, get the power glove. Well, not power glove, the new stamp, get a new stamp ability. And then go back to the beach and help Tampa and crew get to the end. So I think I'll call it quits here. Made good progress. Now the next session will just be climbing. We'll deal with some raptors and stuff. So I'll see you guys in the next episode.